We're at the Fujimi booth. You can probably tell because we just showed you the logo. And there is some really cool stuff here. This is a manufacturer that is not showing a lot of signs of an economic downturn. First of all, now these aren't, these aren't products that we know are coming out yet, but they're just kind of putting them out here to, uh, to gather opinions. We have the 2007 F1, Ferrari F1 here. Uh, these are still, of course, these gray mock-ups. And then over here, we have a 1987 Ferrari F187. So they're really getting into F1 here. And I couldn't be happier because I love F1. Moving inside, we've got more Ferrari action here. They're in really good terms with Ferrari, these guys. Uh, we've got uh, new kits besides the, uh, the great 126 kits that they've already had out. Now they're going to be doing the Ferrari F99. And uh, this, is, this is already coming out. In fact, when you see this video, it may be already on sale. And then moving over here, Although we don't have all of the data on this one yet, this is also a confirmed release. They're going to do a Dino 206 GT, and uh, this is uh, also a full new tool. And sliding over here, this is the one we knew about before the show, a non-Ferrari F1 release. We're really happy about this too, the McLaren MP46. Now, of course, back in the 1980s, our good friends over at Tamiya had a whole series of McLaren uh, cars, and as a big fans of the genre will know, they had the MP46, but in 12th scale. They didn't have it in 20th scale. Uh, they had all the other McLaren cars in 20th scale. So this actually perfectly fills a gap in the releases uh, in of the great you know golden era of McLaren in the 1980s. Uh, so we have the 46 in 20th scale. It's going to be in markings from the 1991 Japan GP. Checking out more cool stuff here at Fujimi. Uh, we've got a all new tooling of the Yamato in, get this, 1 500th scale. We've got a lot of kits out there in 1 700th, about this big. We've got a lot of kits out there in, well, not a lot, but a few kits in 1 350th scale. That's about this big and larger. Uh, so 1 500th scale is just about the right size, as you can see here, compared to my hand, which is pretty big anyway. But it's a full hull kit, uh, loads of detail, and just the right size for any modeler's shelf.